Final suspect in the killing of a Tyler man is sentenced to 45 years in prison. Lorenzo Martinez pleaded guilty this morning to aggravated robbery for his role in the 2021 death of Jesse McNeely. KLTV 7's J.D. Conti has our story. The third and final suspect in the murder of a Tyler man is heading to prison. Lorenzo Martinez pleaded guilty to aggravated robbery today and will spend 45 years in prison. His co-defendants in the case have already pled guilty. Andres Yurtia, the shooter, is spending the rest of his life in prison. Jason Rhodes pled guilty to aggravated robbery and is spending 20 years behind bars. Smith County District Attorney Jacob Putman says the trio went looking for trouble. These three individuals went out looking for someone to rob, something to steal, and they found the victim in this case outside of his home at night. Uh, they tried to take cash, which the victim didn't have. They tried to take his car. There was a struggle over the gun. Uh, Andres Uratia shot our victim, uh, killed him there in the street. Martinez was originally charged with capital murder but pleaded guilty to the lesser charge of aggravated robbery. Lorenzo Martinez uh, had driven the car there. He got out during the struggle uh, and then got back in the car. Mr. Rhodes, who pled to 20 years, was a passenger in the car and then drove the car away from the scene. With the final suspect behind bars, some justice for the McNeely family. And we get as much justice for him as we can uh, based on what we think a jury in Smith County would do. But no matter what we do, uh, they're going to be grieving uh, for the rest of their lives. J.D. Conti, KLTV 7 News. And the DA told us Martinez and his co-defendants did not know McNeely and said the crime was completely random. Martinez will be eligible for parole after 22 years.